episode of Cupcakes and Pupcakes. This week we'll be making peanutty treats. Let's get started. We're gonna start by mixing all of our dry ingredients together. So you want two and a fourth cups of whole wheat flour, three fourths of a cup of all purpose flour, and a tablespoon and a quarter of baking powder. Go ahead and mix that all together and then you can set it off to the side. In a separate bowl, go ahead and add a cup and a fourth of peanut butter. Make sure it's peanut butter that doesn't have any xylitol because that's toxic for dogs. Somebody wants some peanut butter. Someone wants to lick some peanut butter. I can already tell these are going to be a big hit. She loves peanut butter. Who loves peanut butter? Oh, got them on your nose. And one cup of milk. And go ahead and stir those two together until they're combined pretty well. So that's what it looks like when you've stirred it all together. Be patient, it does take a little bit of time at first. And then what we're going to do next is we're going to gradually stir the peanut butter mixture into the flour mixture. Next we're going to knead the dough by hand, so I'm going to want to take off my rings for this one. And basically since it's all still a little bit crumbly right now, what we're going to do is we're going to just take chunks of it and just kind of like pack them together. Like this. A little handful here. A little handful here. And you just want to squeeze it together with your, in your palms. So and just like pack it together and that'll help make it more of a dough form. You just kind of keep massaging that together and add some more when this when the first part gets a little firm. And then we'll be able to roll it out. So we've got our dough balls. I've made three smaller ones. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna sprinkle down some flour. Over our work surface, and we're going to roll it out to our desired thickness between about a fourth of an inch or half an inch thick. Um, my preferred method of rolling out dough is to take a piece of wax paper and place it on top, press it down. Then take your rolling pin and roll on top of the dough, so on top of the wax paper. So I have the wax paper down, and then you just roll it on top like you would with any other cookie dough. You just peel it back, and you're ready to cut your shape. Pick your desired cookie cutter. I'm going to use this cute little dog-shaped one. Cut out your cookies. Peel away your excess dough. Carefully transfer your cookies onto your baking sheet. Just be careful not to break them or mess up the shape. Set your oven to 400 degrees. And then we're going to place these cookies in for about 40 minutes. Just keep your eye on them. You never know. I have 25 minutes left on my timer, but I do smell them starting to burn just a tin. Just a little bit. So I'm taking them out now. And then we're 
we're gonna let those cool off for a bit before we try them. But they look kind of cute. Look at the little doggies. This guy burned his foot. He's probably the guy I'm smelling. All right, now the moment of truth. Time to test one. All right, I'm fixing. I'm gonna try it first, cause I don't want to eat after you, and you don't need an entire whole treat. So, let me uh, turn this around here. All right, here we go. <laughs> yeah. It's dry, but you can taste the peanut butter, so there's that. Not bad. Not one of my favorites, though. Which is weird, because I love peanut butter, so I thought maybe I'll really, really love this one. Man. Okay, time to let her eat it. Dick. I'll grab the peanut bar. So hard to see with that cone. Oh, hopefully we'll be out of the cone in a couple weeks. Actually, like last next week, hopefully. Next week, hopefully. Oh, is it tasty? Oh, is it tasty? Go ahead, eat the crumbs. Well, I guess that one was a hit. And I love how cute they look as little puppy dogs. Alrighty, guys. Well, uh, if you try this recipe at home, definitely leave it in the comments below and tell me how your dog liked it. Um, and thanks for watching. And go ahead and click that subscribe button if you like this and you want to see more treat videos or just follow us in general and see what we do in, on a weekly basis. And that's it. Until next time. Bye, guys.